Yeah, unbelievably happy. It was just um, I like a, a really well. I felt like I had a really good season. I got a lot of involvement with the first team. It felt like it was it was two years, well, three years of really hard work that I felt like it had paid off. So when I saw that contract when it came up with my emails, I was just ecstatic. I like, rang the family and was just saying how happy I was. And it just felt like it was a dream kind of come true as well with all the hard work I put in. And so obviously with, with Chris Turner coming in for the next three years, it's really good. Like You see where for the future of the club can actually go to. Obviously, we're always inspiring to be in the Premiership. And now to actually see that the academy lads are getting a shot to actually help create this future for this, the club. And I've obviously I've been here since I was 17, so I actually can see this future of this club developing and getting to the Premiership where we've always wanted to be is unbelievable. It's a great, a great opportunity, I find. Not at all, it, it came so quick. I, I think I played against Bath Uni and Varsity for Leeds Beckett in the Superbooks League. And then, and then Baz, uh, their academy coach, went, oh, you, you're going to make your debut against Jersey away in the B&I. And I was like, oh, so it's that I couldn't stop smiling. I was like, this is unbelievable. Then the next week, they were like, oh, you're going to be on the bench again. So I was like, oh, my God. Then the next week, you're like, you're... so I, I'd, I'd, I'd never been happier. It was, it was so unexpected, but I felt like I'd worked hard enough, so I felt like I was ready for it. I just need, I just trying to build myself into it, but it was unexpected, but it was really good. I think there's a, there's more of a, a feeling that if you put the hard work in now, you show what you can do, you're going to get the opportunity, where I think that's such a big driving factor. So it's a massive driving factor for me, where if I know I'm putting the energy in and I develop all these skills I need to, I'm going to get the opportunity to actually show what I can do on, on that first team stage. I went to Bevy Grammar School and then went to do a BTEC in sport at uh, Bishop Burton. So I joined their rugby academy system, what was before the ace there. I really enjoyed that. I actually felt like it was obviously the kind of more full-time rugby environment where we, kept, we, we go to school, then we'll go straight into rugby, and I really enjoyed it. It just made me love the sport even more and love like, the environment of training full-time and going to the gym and then going to rugby training. And it developed my game so much that I just really enjoyed them two years, and I really got a good education out of it as well. I did three years at Leeds Beckett, so in the first year I was predominantly on the bench unfortunately for the Leeds Beckett side, but I really got some good in insight and like learned a lot of stuff. And then second year I played a lot of game time with them. And it really helped me just get that game time and get back. So that was a tough year of like getting a lot of game time and then trying to educate myself and go to my lectures and stuff. But I found the mix was really good because it takes you outside of that rugby, just non-stop rugby, where you can go to a lecture and you learn about ping pong. So it was really good. And then third year, Obviously put quite a lot of strain on me with regards to getting a lot of first team stuff and then getting that, that involvement with first team and then having to do my dissertation, etc. But it like again, it was a really good break and it felt like you're not just limiting yourself to that rugby. You've got, a, well, I feel like I've got a degree now and it's shown me so many options that I can do outside, outside of rugby and I'm not just limited on what one thing of coaching rugby because I've done it. Yeah, it's been really good. It's a big eye opener because last year I did all the academy um, pre-season so that was a lot different. This is very intense but it's really good, the, the long days. But you know, when you, you know you've had a hard day when you get home and you just fall asleep straight away but they're really enjoyable and you get, feel like you're getting a lot out of them. I just want to help the club, so help the team as well and just play, as, play get as much minutes and game time as I can. I want to play, play well and, and help help us regress where we want to be and get us to the, the top four and push for the, well push for promotion this year and show what, what a club we should be doing.